Hey guys, how you doing? It's Beth. I'm so excited. I got something for um I got something from Paige for the for the challenge for this month. I'm so happy because you know what? I haven't heard from anyone. It's kind of like really um sad. You know why? This is really embarrassing. So, thank God for Peggy, JP Peggy too. Thank you so much for doing that tutorial on um where to find my inbox because it moved. So, um, then I thought, oh, I found it, but there's no messages. Like, I haven't gotten one message in, like, two days. And usually, you know, I get a couple of messages, nothing. So, I messaged, um, Mona, 63 Sonatech. And I'm so sorry, Mona. Mona has a sinus headache, and I bothered her. I feel so bad. I'm sorry. Anyway, I'm like, can you just do me a favor and, um, you know, <laughs> like, please, can you be my friend? <laughs> Um, but I was like, can you just like send a message so I know if this is working or not? Because it's kind of weird, like two days and not one person. You know, turns out it's working. <laughs> it's just that nobody wants to talk to me. And that's okay. It's all right. At least I know it's working. So if and when someone does want to talk to me, you know, I'll be there. So that's good. Um, so thank you, Peggy. And thank you, Mona. Okay. So I'm working on my um, albums for my crop that I'm going to. My crop around the clock kind of thing. The late, late night, I don't know what it's called. Night crop. Cropaholics. I don't know what it is. I am so packed and ready to go. I'm bringing my five drawer thing on wheels. I have two boxes, a small refrigerator. I was going to bring a U-Haul. I think I might have to leave that one at home. I don't know. Because I don't know what I need. I don't know what I'm going to do. Turns out, I guess I have crafty ADD. I didn't know this. I mean, I knew that I get excited about crafting because it's kind of all so new to me. Um, but I actually believe that I have crafty ADD because this is what happened. So I'm going along making my little album so I'd have something to work on at my crop. And I look over and there is the envelope punch board that Rachel, Deja Vu Bad Girl, sent to me, which I don't make cards, so I've been looking at it and looking at it, and I'm like, what am I doing with it? I don't know. And so the other day, yesterday or the day before, I don't remember which day, um, I don't know what happened. My brain went off in another direction, and I went on YouTube and looked up tutorials for this thing. Holy crap, people! We all need one. Everyone needs to get one of these. You wouldn't believe it. You're not going to believe it. Okay, so this is the thing. Not only can you make envelopes. Look at this. You can make like little, like these little lunch sack things. And look at how cute this is. This little like uh, baskety thing. Right? So, okay. So then it catches my eye. Exploding envelope. You know how I feel about that. Which, can I just say for a second, I also have YouTube ADD. Um, just for a second. Because I had bought the box punch board. Because I wanted to make boxes. So, I had a box. And I was downstairs with Emily. Um, and I'm like, look, I made a box. And she opened it and she was like, oh, okay. I'm like, what? I made this box. She's like, yeah, but nothing popped out. It's kind of a letdown. Well, you know what happened then. So then I had to make another box. And this is what I made. Oi, I don't know what I brought. Oh, I know what I dropped. So then I made this box, which is a little bit bigger. And boom! <gasps> I don't know how you see it. Boom! She wanted confetti to come popping out, but it wouldn't. But look, boom! From a box. Okay, anyway. So, exploding envelope. Okay, so I look on the tutorial. Now, this is the thing. Okay, I know. I don't know anything. I'll, I'll admit, I am as scrap challenged as they come, okay? I believe it's me and maybe a four-year-old. We're at the same level when it comes to understanding, you know, crafting and what to do. So, I'm watching this tutorial on the exploding box. And this woman is like, well, you have to... Look at your piece of paper, 
the size of your paper. Look on the column for the card size so that you can figure out the score line. You put it up here along the ruler, move it over two inches. You have to turn it to this way, multiply it by three, face the paper towards the northwest direction, and punch. I'm like, uh, excuse me, what size piece of paper? I was like lost. So this is what I did, and I'm going to show you. I made one of these. This is my exploding envelope, and I'll tell you how I did it. So easy for the four-year-old out there and for me. Um, I'm doing this for you. Everyone else who gets this, who can do the math, I'm sorry. But I'm just going to tell you what I did. All right, so first, this is what it is. Okay, so um, you open it, and boom! <laughs> you don't have to do that. But I was thinking, you know, what if you did like something like, um, you know, five reasons I love you or something on the on the top, and then on each one you put something, and then boom, next one, and then you do another one, boom, and then the next one, and this one. Boom! And inside, your uh, I love you, my perfect rose. And then I just took some roses and I put some lace and I did the blingy and I did a whole thing. It was so easy. So this is what you do. Again, it's only for me and the four-year-old out there. Now listen, honey, have your mommy punch the board for you, okay? This is what you do. I took a 10 by 10 piece of paper. I'll start over here, okay. So I took a 10 by 10, people, 10 by 10 piece of paper. <laughs> and then I brought it so that it lined up to four and three quarters on this little hoodinky board. Where's the four and three quarters? There we go. Four and three quarters, punch and score. So then you turn it and you line it up to four and three quarters, punch and you score. And you do that around all four sides. This is 10 by 10. Then I decreased the paper by a half an inch. So then I went to nine and a half. So nine and a half by nine and a half, brought it up and I decreased up here by a quarter inch. So then I lined it up to nine and a half. I mean to four and a half, sorry. Punch and score. Turn it, four and a half, punch and score. Then the next one, again, going down half an inch, people, at nine inches. So nine by nine. And then I brought it to, you're right, four and a quarter. Punch and score all around. And then the last one I did was eight and a half by eight and a half, and I brought it to four. So the paper decreased half inch on either side. So it went from ten to nine and a half to nine to eight and a half. And up here, I just measured it to four and three quarters, to four and a half, to four and a quarter, to four. That's it. Bada bing, bada bang, you're done. Boom! Exploding envelope. And you can do as many pages as you want. And then I got a little crafty and I started like actually doing, well, this one didn't come out good. I figured out that you can't really use a punch around the page unless it's actually a punch around the page. So I did it more just on, you know, this one actually didn't come out too bad. Um, but I, I didn't attempt to do punch around the page the way I did the other one. Um, but I mean, you can do anything really. And you can have as many pages as you want. Just make sure that whatever it is, the paper goes half inch, decreases half inch, and you line it up a quarter of an inch, you know, going down. That's all it is. And then you just glue this part or, or tape it so that each thing looks like this. And then you take Velcro. And one side goes like this. And then you Velcro the ends on the other. And I can't do it. Boom! And you have an envelope inside an envelope inside an envelope. How cool is that? So excited. 
So, I mean, when you think about it, I mean, these Hallmark cards are like $4.99, $5, whatever. So I'm just making a whole bunch of these um, for Valentine's Day this year. Because they're so fast, so easy. I was with, you know, sitting down with Emily, at the, you know, in the living room, and I just cut these all out, glued them together, and now all I have to do is decorate, and I can do different things. How great is that? So, Rachel, oh my God, thank you. Thank you, thank you. This is the best thing. Seriously, people, if you haven't gotten one of these, um, it's really worth the fight the $15.99 or $16 or whatever um, because a lot of the stuff I've seen dies for and you don't need to. You can actually do it, you know, with this one little thing. Okay, so I did, that's just a public announcement, a public service announcement, that's what it's called, um, because I was having issues and I wanted to share my issues with everyone else. Um, okay, so then I got stuff in the mail and I'm going to show you, but first... I'm really kind of getting concerned because, um, well, no, really, I shouldn't be because it's only the ninth, right? Okay, I'm good. I'm good. It's just that I haven't really gotten that many um, entries. So I'm thinking, you know, I'm going to have more prizes than people. Hmm. Oh, well. But Paige, she sent to me. So let me show you what she sent. <laughs> So excited every day I come home from from work and I like run to the mailbox I'm like anything anything and there's nothing it was like the inbox it's like anything anything nothing but it's okay all right so Beth oh my god <gasps> oh, I bet you used the envelope punch board didn't you look at this beautiful thing look at this this is gorgeous. This is gorgeous. This is gorgeous. Oh my God. Happy Valentine's Day. Oh my God. It's a, I can put it like a decoration. I put like, Valentine's Day, I go crazy. I do like the red heart lights. I have like the, um, Oh, you know, the tinsel stuff that you put on trees while I get the red Christmas when it's all done and, you know, and everything is like 75 to 90 percent off. That's when I get all my red stuff. Isn't that funny that they don't like put that stuff aside for Valentine's Day? That's when I get all my red stuff. And I mean, the whole place goes crazy. I mean, I just have red everywhere. I even do, you know, when we have dinner, it's always red dye in my um, mashed potatoes. We always have red mashed potatoes. Um, and you, oh, wow, okay, oh, this is a big letter. Okay, but I won't read it all now. Um, okay, this is an oversized Valentine to match up with your big heart. Oh, Paige, I love you. Thank you so much. You made my week. You really did. I'll read the rest later because I don't want to, I don't want to, you know, you know. But anyway, um, okay, so, she, oh, I'm so excited that she sent cards for the St. Jude's. Let me show you. These are absolutely beautiful cards. Okay, look at this. I'm, I really shouldn't show every single one, but I mean, really, look at this. Look at how adorable this is, and then she uses the lace. I should use lace on my, on my uh, exploding envelope things. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. And my boxes. You know what? Because I can put, like, candy in here, and then they open and boom! I just love that. I love it. Okay, sorry. Got carried away. See? I have serious problems. I'm so focused. Normally, I'm like the most focused person you'll ever meet. Except when it comes to crafts and shopping and cleaning. And don't even get me started if there's a party. And holidays, of course. But other than that, like totally, I'm right there, you know? Look at that. I'm cuckoo for you. And it's got like the boing. These are absolutely happy Valentine's Day. Look at these. Oh my God. Oh my God. I wish you could see. This is like cork here. Like she does serious. 
I fancy you. And look at the little owl. Be my Valentine. These are awesome, Paige. Thank you so much. Oh my God. You, I mean, just a whole bunch. What does this say? I, I stink your sweet. Ah, that's funny. Instead of I think you're sweet. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, you know what? This would be a good one. Oh, it says Happy Valentine's Day. I was going to say for veteran for the veterans because we're going to be doing one of those challenges. Um, not next month because remember next month is for the the scrapbook page, either for a baby boy or a baby girl. We'll get into that later. I'm going as fast as I can. I'm going. I'm going so fast. I mean, oh my God. You, really? How? See, this is the problem. I'm not focused enough for cards. That's what it is. You really do need to be able to focus because you need to. You, the, I can't even speak. It's just, these are so beautiful. But to think about, you know, don't even get this stuff. I, I can't talk. I'm so excited. I'm so happy. Thank you so much. Really, I was starting to get nervous. I'm not going to lie. I was getting a little nervous. Oh, this is so funny. Look at this. Look at, oh my God. This is so adorable. These are so perfect. All right, all right. Sorry, people, almost. And then I'll show you what I got. Because I told you, I'm, I'm a little bit of a, um, I have a little bit of a shopping ADD problem. Oh, this is so cute. Look at that. I mean, the detail and the, look at, I mean, the, te if you just, you know, you know, because you guys all do this. I do not. So this to me is amazing. Amazing. The Oh my God. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. And thank you so much. The kids, the parents, they're going to love these. So I really appreciate it. Um, I just wanted to say one other quick announcement. Um, Bernadette. So I just want to confirm before I mail out Peggy's, I did mail out to um, Rose, who was Michelle Holland's daughter, her package to thank her because she sent such the cutest little love monsters. And um, so I sent her a package and of course, Karen Sue, um, who was Scrappy K. Sue, also K. Sue 1616 and who knows what else. I think she's hiding from the law. Um, anyway, I sent out your prize for your idea. Um, but if I could just confirm before I send out Peggy's thing, are you saying that this box is for me? I don't want to get attached to it if it's not, I, and it's okay. I totally get it. Peggy really, I mean, she's amazing and deserves this box. If it is for me, I just need to know because I'm going to, um, I'm going to have to put it next to my bed and look at it and maybe use it and um, cherish it forever. But I don't want to cherish it if it's not for me. So just a quick little, you know, because you said the yellow box, but then the other thing had, oh, I already put it up. Okay. Um, oh, it's right behind my kids. Right there. But I don't want to, you know, if it's, if it's not for me. So if we could just confirm that. And I know you called. This is the thing with the calling. Again, you know, my husband's down in the basement. I'm up three floors, up in, you know, the third floor. So he gets the phone and he doesn't tell me until he comes up to go to bed. So anyway, that was, that was the box that Bernadette made, who's Auntie Bernie. For those of you that don't know, check out her channel, amazing. Everyone is so talented, crazy talented. So thank you for that. And Paige, thank you. <laughs> I'm so happy. Okay. Um, let me just show you quick, quick, quick as the bunny what I got so far. 
I'm still waiting on a lot of stuff. I seriously had a problem around Christmas, not going to lie. Um, I got this. I think this is Peachy Cheap. Did anyone get a uh, grab, you know, that bag of crap or bag of scrap, whatever it is, a bag of something? Um, and I don't even know how much it was. I did it, I thought I ordered through Scrapbook Daily for $14.99. But this is, I think, from Peachy Cheap. So did I do both? It's very possible. So let me show you what I got. This is the you don't know what you're getting thing. So I got, and uh, I would say pretty much all of this will be part of giveaways, just so you know. Again, that's why I show most of this stuff. Not just because I'm really excited about everything I buy, um, but because a lot of this stuff is going to you guys anyway. So this is called the Midway October Afternoon Rubber Stamps. And this is what they look like. See, I don't do the coloring. I don't do these stamps. So, you know, this will definitely be one of those giveaway things. This is um, also October afternoon. And it's all kinds of, you know, things. The glare. The glare. So it seems to be a lot of October afternoon. And then um, these are rub-ons. Yeah, rub-ons. And, oh, Hey Boy. Hey Boy 6x6. Six six. Um, and Midway Designer Brads. And this is um, graph, uh, Basic Gray. Hipster. This will actually be kind of cute. I'm not going to open it, but it would be cute like for Father's Day or something. You know, maybe... I don't know. What do I know? Um, this is Christy Tomlinson Designs. Mask Flower. I'm going to try this because I remember when um, uh, JB Lady uh, Scrapper 48. Is that right? JB Lady. I just know her as Johnny Depp's wife. What can I tell you? Karen. Um, I mean, she does like mixed meat. She... You know, she does everything. But she's also been crafting since, you know, who knows? Forever. She's really good. Um, but she uses the masks. She uses these things, these stencil things. I'm going to try it. I don't know what I'm going to do yet, but I'm trying it. I'm going to, this I'm keeping. I'm going to. And this one is um, My Mind's Eye, also Brad's thing. I'm for $14.99. If this is the one, I might have spent twenty dollars. I don't know. I don't know. Buttons. Look at these. Match. Oh, pretty trim. Uh oh, heart washi tape. This will be good to go with the. Um, I have a lot of prizes here, people. You guys. Somebody better send me a card. I swear to God. I swear to God. And then this washi tape. And a feather. How pretty is that? And then I got these. Wows. Glitter. Is that what these are? Glitter? Or are they the embossing things? Wow. Cotton candy. I don't know what they are. So. Um, okay. I got from... Okay, so that was... I don't know. But we'll find out. Um, I had to go to Target. No, this time I really did because I needed some frozen food. Because I get the Lean Cuisines, you know, for lunch. And um, I like fish. How old am I that I eat fish? I know. I'm old. What can I tell you? I'm old and I'm fat. I know it. You don't have to tell me. Um, but the supermarket has, like, no fish or they have, like, gross stuff. So I decided to try Target. I never go there, but they have a frozen food section. They had all the fish I wanted, which was great. And then they had on uh, clearance Christmas stuff, which I wasn't going to do. I didn't, I have not stepped foot in a Michael's, like, in I don't know how long, or an AC Moore, because I'm not buying any of that kind of stuff. Target, of course, you know. 
it was on the way to the frozen food section. I had to do it. So these were four dollars, four dollars and forty-eight cents. The Kane Company, the double-sided, which are cute, right? And I got two of these. So actually, I'm going to do a, a drawing um, on this video. So if you leave a comment, <laughs> I know. How will I know? Nobody's commenting. I'm going to have to start using my tin can and rope again, which is very hard for people to hear. I have to scream. And even then, you know, it's like I can talk to the person in the next room, but that's it. I don't know. You know what? Try. See if you can comment. I can't comment back to you, as it turns out now. I had to do, I did one big one at the top. I was able to do that because I had my address. And then I looked at it and it was really creepy looking, like having my address there. Um, so I took it off. Although it's still out there, of course. I don't know. You know what? What are they going to take, really? Um, but anyway, if you just, don't leave a comment. Don't, you don't have to say anything. Just so I know that it's working. Just say, it's working. Something like that. And um, I'm going to give away one of these. And so I got two of these. Um, but I'll give one away. And they had all of these, all their sticker and all their other stuff on sale. So I'll throw some of this stuff in too. Like for 58 cents, a dollar eighteen. Look at how cute this is. Look at how adorable this is. I love this. A dollar eighteen. I'm gonna put that with the paper. That'll also be included too. And then a bunch of these. These were a dollar eighteen. So I just got a whole bunch of these because you know they had the red sticker, and you know how I feel about that. And I also had to get these. I already have like almost everything I need for Emily's graduation party. <laughs> I know it's in six months. I, I have to be ready. So, how cute, right, for the straws? Okay. So that was a Target. I mean, there's more, but you really don't need to see it all. This is what I got from the other order from Joanne's. I got the this paper, I mean, these flowers to go with the engraver. I don't know paper pads here. Another of the sunny days. Um, lyric. Oh, another sunny days engraver. So like the Lyric and the engraver, they have a lot of the black. So um, I got the, these flowers to go with it. And um, I got this so I can do the, um, these floor, what are they called? What are these called? Rosettes, rosettes, yes. Because Chris, One Crack Mom, made the most beautiful ones for Hanukkah for me. Thank you, Chris. So now I can make some and send them off to people. Some stuff here. And then this was Hello, Hello Pastel chipboard pieces. I don't even think I got a paper pad for this Hello Pastel. I don't know why I got this. Um, oh, I got TurboTac. I got this and... Oy, this fell. Do you think this will be enough glue for my crop? I don't know. I don't know. I've never been. I'm packing like I'm going to a third world country for a month. I swear to God. I don't know what I... I don't know. I hope that's enough glue. All right. Then I got um, Once Upon a Springtime, the stamps. The stamp thing. It turns out um, I can't use the big stamps. I'm not good. But these small, so I can use these, I think, I hope. And then I got this, because I saw, follow the paper trail maybe? It was somebody who did um, a mini scrapbook using envelopes. I don't know what she did. But anyway, she fancied up the, she used just plain, I don't know what she did. I don't know. But then I had to get this so that I could make the edges look cool. I got. Oh, I got two and another tacky glue. Okay, so I should be good, right, with three things of glue. I mean, it's going from 10 to 10. 
I'd say 12 hours of serious, you know, scrapbooking, I think. I don't know. And then uh, these are um, the fairy journaling note cards, which are not the same ones as the ones that I've had that I had before that are the big ones. Size people, you know. Oh, and then these wooden button things, which is um, Sunrise Sunset Collection. I don't think I have that paper either. And then I get another one in my lifetime. I just love this paper pad. I don't know what it is. I just love it. So I had to get another one because, you know, you never know. God forbid it. They stop and it happens. You know, things stop. What else did I get? Oh, here's another one of these. So I have three of those. That's right. Okay. Then I got these stickers. This one goes to the Lyric. And this one goes to Lifetime. So I'll include like this with the paper pad for one of my giveaways. So I think that was Joanne's. Okay. So then... It's really bad, right? You know what's really bad? My husband is working a double tonight. He worked a double last night. And I'm sitting here showing you all the stuff that I bought. Isn't that awful? Although I do work like three or four hours overtime every week too, but you know. I feel, see, now I feel guilty, which makes me stressed, which makes me want to buy. It's like a vicious cycle. Um, so eBay, once again, strikes again, 50 pieces. I think this costs 90 cents. I don't know. 50 pieces. Can anyone see it? Because I can't. I don't know. Um, then Oriental Trading, because I got like all my paper goods for the graduation party. I mean, I only have six months. <laughs> um, these were $2. And it comes with these. It's actually Halloween. But for $2, it comes with all these things. That's really good. So I got three packages. And then for $4.49, 300 pieces. But these are like bigger ones. I got that and I got red. And um, I got more of the... Um, and then I went on Blitzy. Last night, the night before, did I already tell you that? That I ordered more doilies? Beautiful ones. I don't even use doilies. I don't know what I'm thinking. And then, oh good. This is what happened. Okay, so now we're at Joann's. Because what happened was I had the 50% off and 25% off. And I had to use that. So, um, I got this. Which I know people like Tombow. I got one once and I didn't like the feel of it. It was like really weird feeling. But um, this one has two different tips. And again, you know, I need it for the crop because I don't know. Do I have enough? I don't know. It's very depressing. Um, and then I used 50% off on the roses. Normally $6.99. So $3.50. I already used some for my, um, you know, my exploding envelope. I actually went back and got another one. Um, these were actually on clearance, and I'm going to use these as prizes, you know, that I give when I use the um, a person's idea, you know, that you get a package of cards, um, envelopes, and embellishments. So this is 12, um, these 12 A7 cards. Looks like they're all silver, but I mean, depending on the, um, depending on the, uh, holiday. I mean, you can dress it up with red, with green, with pastels for Easter. So they were $1.97 because they were part of like the Christmas thing. I don't know. Um, and then these were not on sale. The little pink bows with the thing. And so I used a 50% off and I think it cost me a dollar something. And the same with these. These were like a dollar twenty-five, and then I used the 40% off or 50% off. I don't know. These were just $1.97. They're um, pink stickers, which I'm just going to include in a prize, which I don't know. I'm telling you, I don't know. I might not have, uh, I, I, I don't know. Um, oh, here's another eBay thing. 
these little, they're all different shapes. And I got these, and I actually got another thing, which I don't know where it is. And these for doodad bags for when I send out, you know, packages to people. Um, and then I got um, two packages of these, and this is how they came, just like this, wrapped in little tissue. And they're brads, but I thought what I'd do is I'd have the black tablecloths and, and put these, punch them in, like to decorate the tablecloths. They're little uh, red glittery flowers. Maybe I'll include some in my doodad bags, too. I think that's everything. So, um, what a mess. Okay, I think I'm done. I'm going to go downstairs now. My daughter's down there with some friends. They're working on biology. I don't know what they're doing. Dissecting things or something. I don't know. All they have to do is open my refrigerator, and they have a project right there for them. I'm telling you. Um, all right, I'm going to clean up. Thank you guys so much. So, okay. Oh, yeah. Okay, so just as a quick reminder that I am I'm doing this, um, sending this out. So just, you know, I'll do I'll, my next... Um, video, I will pull a winner for the um, that paper cat if you're interested. Then um, attempt to leave me a comment. <laughs> Honest to God, I don't understand it. I really don't. I'm going to figure it out. I don't know. Thank you again to Peggy and to Mona and to Paige for the beautiful cards. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. And Rachel, I can't even begin to thank you for this envelope punch board. It's the best thing I ever got, as it turns out. I love it. I love everything. All right, everyone have a good weekend. It's almost the weekend. Stay warm. I'll talk to you. Bye.